and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a empties review for you guys. So I am going to start a empty series where every time I go through um, a lot of products, I put it to the side and I don't throw it away so I can show you guys what I'm using and mini reviews on these products. So it will typically range from beauty, hair care, skin care, um, anything along those lines. So I got my bag and the first thing, I've been out of these for a while though. Um, these are the Equate Nighttime Soothing um, Face Wipes and I used to like these very much but they make my skin very dry. So you'll see what I use in alternative to these makeup wipes but I don't use them anymore because they irritate my skin and make my skin very dry. But in an alternative, what I use instead is the Cellar Water. This brand is the Garnier brand and basically you just put this on a cotton round or a cotton pad and just take off all of your makeup. And this is for sensitive skin as well. It works amazing. I didn't repurchase this one. The one I got is by Simply, Simple, Simply. I'll insert a picture of the brand I got, but I still got the same cleansing water and I love it as well. So next thing I went through is the L'Oreal Infallible Matte Setting Spray. And if you've seen any of my previous videos, I use this nonstop. If you have oily skin or if you want a matte finish, this is the setting spray I will um, tell you to get or recommend to you because it's amazing and I use the uh, L'Oreal um, matte foundation with it as well and doing it together using these combos together is great and I love it so I'm definitely going to repurchase this I just haven't gotten around to doing it and I even when I was traveling I even purchased the mini travel size one so and I went through this one um, as well so I went through two, but I'm just gonna go ahead and get the bigger one. I didn't even know they made like a mini travel size one until I went to Walmart and saw it. Next thing I went through is the Lakeside, Fall Lakeside Breeze Hand Lotion. This is from Bath & Body Works. It smells really good. It got me into the fall mood, but now I'm on my Christmas stuff, so I'm not gonna be repurchasing this. I don't even think they have this in stores anymore because you know, it's seasonal. So I think they have all their Christmas smells out now. So I did go through a bottle. See, I've had this bag for so long, I forgot. So this is what I was talking about earlier. This is the simple um, cleansing water as well. I, I prefer this one um, rather than the Garnier one. Um, I really don't know why. I think it's maybe like a dollar or so cheaper. And I got this at uh, Walgreens. So either one is great. Next for my hair, I went through the Not Your Mother's Way to Grow shampoo. And this is sulfate free and for all hair types. I just really love this for the, the smell of it. I think it smells awesome, but I'm not gonna repurchase it because I've been going, or I've been loving my Curl's Daughter uh, I think it's black castor oil line. I have the shampoo, the hair mask, and the leave-in conditioner. Since I'm tra transitioning to <sighs> natural, I've been trying to find stuff that my hair likes and will cling to, and it's been doing really well with that. So I think I'm gonna keep on using that. Okay, next I have some eyeliners. This one, liquid eyeliner, is from NYX and this is just their black matte liquid liner. I love, 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 love the brush on this. It's so tiny, it's so precise, and I can really get my liners, my eyeliner, you know, thin or thick as I like it and wing it out or whatever. And I also have the e.l.f. Precision Liquid Eyeliner. This one has a tiny, well, it's not as tiny of a brush as the NYX one, but it's still a small brush. So next I have the Purity 
um, one step facial cleanser and so basically for this what you're supposed to do is just put this all over your face and it takes off all of your makeup and you wash your face with this and this is amazing so usually what I do is I step one I go through this like soapy cleanser wash off all my makeup then I go through with my um, cleanser water take off the rest of my mm, the rest of my makeup and then go through with my regular skincare routine so I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy the full-size bottle of this I just grabbed the little you know little mini bottles that they have in um, Sephora you know impulse buy but this was a really good impulse buy I think I'm gonna buy the full size of this last but not least I have the wet n wild set um photo fo photo focus oh, let me turn it to the English side setting spray and this is the matte formula as well this is a great alternative to the L'Oreal setting spray it's cheaper um, although you do get a smaller portion of product in this bottle it still works just as great I prefer the L'Oreal one I think it lasts longer but the Wet n Wild one it lasts a pretty long time as well so it's just a preference that is all of the products I have used up so far if you like these types of videos and if you want me to continue these videos make sure you give me a thumbs up if you have any questions or um, any comments about any of these products that you've used or you have a different opinion or experience with these products definitely leave me a comment down below let's start a conversation so um, until next time you guys